here I get a quick look at my trailer before I dirty it all up. Just uh, weatherproofed it. This bare product, whatever I got from Home Depot. Turned out really nice though. I think it looks good. Home Depot. Here's some bare product. Uh, it comes like that? Or is that used? The paint. It's it's like a oh, weatherproofing. It. Not oh, paint, oh, but a weatherproofing. Oh. Here's like like a seal. Like a seal. Yeah. Okay. I think it looks good. Yeah, I thought it was new wood. No, it turned out a lot nicer than I thought it would. So, I think it looks cool. Nice. So the task at hand is kind of mound this dirt all up here and then yeah and then put these wood chips on top.
brush and it's it's pretty smooth it's mounted here in the middle which is what we want it and it doesn't need to be per too perfect because we're going to put all those wood chips over it so this is a, uh, a memorial garden so it's going to look nice when it's all done uh, there's going to be some plants and uh, I think maybe a couple small trees not sure but, yep this is going good so far and now we'll get the uh, wood chips in here
video cut out because my battery ran out. These batteries on these GoPros are terrible. They only last about an hour. I had to recharge it. Um, but I got all the wood chips on here. Uh, smoothed it out with a rake a little bit. Only because trying to do it with the front end loader, it's just too much pressure. You just need a lighter sort of spread for it. And then still had some extra, so just mounted them up there where he took out a tree a couple months ago. And then took out these trees over here. This one I thought was going to be really tough. It was only tough because I couldn't see and the branches kept falling in my face. But you can see it just ripped right out. It's pretty good size. This stuff is all out, it's just piled there. Uh, there's where that big one was. And a couple small ones over here. Probably hard to hear because the wind is crazy today. Uh, you can probably see that in the video, all the leaves blowing by it super fast. So, but it's about 70 degrees, so it feels fine out here. It's just really windy. But that kind of wraps up the project for now. I think next year is when uh, I'm going to plant the flowers and get the memorial plaques and stuff out here. So I think it looks pretty good for now. There's going to be flowers going around the whole edge of it. And uh, I think a couple of he said Japanese maple bushes or small trees, some, I don't know. I'm not a landscaper, but that's, that's that. Um, really tips I have for like, when you're using the, the front end loader to uh, like back drag and smooth stuff out like this, is I always I always try to start with the loader you know more like that to really start pulling it and then I slowly maneuver it back as I'm going backwards and that that'll get you nice and smooth I found so if you got another method cool let me know that's that's kind of what I use. So and that's a wrap because it's windy. Son, I have good news. Oh, okay. I wasn't hurt today. Yet. But... Oops. <laughs> Almost. <laughs> the day's not over. I mean, it it's only like two o'clock. Ha, ha, ha.